Have you ever been standing outside on the sidewalk and suddenly a ambulance or a police car zips by, and, but on their way towards you, while they're moving toward you, it sounds like a very high pitch and a very high frequency sound. But as soon as they pass you up, that pitch really drops all of a sudden and, and the sound gets very low pitched in comparison. So why does that happen? Well, it's something called the Doppler effect. And the way the Doppler effect works is this. If you're a person standing over here, as this car is driving towards you with some velocity, what happens is its sirens are producing sound waves and those sound waves are traveling in all directions. Some of those waves are traveling for toward you, but since the car is also moving towards you while its waves are traveling towards you, it's sort of catching up with the waves in a sense. And that causes the waves to get bunched much more closely together. And so you get these really short wavelengths, which results in a very high frequency sound because as waves get closer together, as that wavelength decreases, your frequency will always increase. And so this person in position one, they're gonna perceive that high frequency as a high pitch because that's how we perceive frequency. Now the person in position two, since the car is moving away from them, as it sends those waves out towards this person, the car is actually getting further and further from the waves simultaneously. And that causes the wavelengths between these waves to actually get really big, so much higher wavelengths, which means the frequency of those sound waves drops quite a bit. And what happens when your frequency drops, that means this person is gonna perceive that sound as a very low pitch sound in comparison to the person in front of the car. So that's the reason why you hear different frequencies depending on where you're standing. Now, this same phenomenon can also be noticed when we analyze light waves. So unlike sound, we don't perceive high frequency as a higher pitch, we see high frequency light as more blue and we see lower frequency light as shifted more red. So what we notice when we look out in space through our telescopes, we notice that stars that are distant from Earth, they all appear to be shifted more red than they should be. So their light is tilted towards the red side of the light spectrum. And so why does that matter? Well, remember, if you're a moving light source like a star, and if we're over here on planet Earth, and that star is moving towards us, we would see those uh, light waves bunched together and that would look more blue shifted. But what we actually see every time we look out at stars is that that light appears to be shifted in the red end of the spectrum, which is evidence that these wavelengths are actually getting longer because red light is higher wavelength. So we're seeing evidence that the stars are moving away from us due to the Doppler effect of light.